All right, so I got my drill set up. Today's topic is going to always, we always do, is first ball control. Receiving it in the air, trapping it. We're gonna work on escaping moves and attacking dribble and dribbling in tight areas. So try your best to see if you can mirror the drill that I have set up for you. First thing first, I'm gonna have to get my back to you. You're gonna go ahead and juggle the ball anywhere between five to 10. I'm gonna pop it up and I'm going to trap it in the air using a croif from behind. So let's juggle a couple to get up and I do a croif from behind. From there, I want to try to make sure that I don't touch my cones. I'm not going to go through the cones. I'm going to pick a side and go out. Then, if I'm there going to decide, I'm going to go ahead and perform a soul change. Through the gate, yes, hopping, using my arms, right. I go back and I do a soul change with the other foot left. Then I'm going to perform and do an under exit move, under exit, escape. And I go ahead and I do the same escape move, a soul change. I come back to where I'm at. And I'm gonna do an outside inside right, outside inside left, every step touching the ball. Bat, 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 and go back home. See if you can try this. But before you try it, I'll go ahead and show you how the trap and the soul change and the one we want attacking drill moves looks like. Ready, set. Next drill, same setup. I'm only gonna go ahead and add something and change the escape move and the 1v1 attacking dribble move. I'm gonna go ahead and juggle a couple, receive it in the air doing a croif, and I'm gonna go ahead and do a small little move right here, pretending that I have pressure and I want to try to create space for me and the pressure. So I've juggled the ball, I pop it up, I do a croif from behind. 
I got a defender in front of me. I'm gonna push towards her or him. I'm gonna create space from behind. I'm gonna drag it back three times. I chose my foot, which is my left. I'm gonna exit with me outside. As you can see, I'm a lefty. So after that, I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna go to the cones diagonal from me. And I'm gonna go ahead and do a slow pivot drag with the right foot. Push, slow pivot drag with the other foot left. My 1v1 attacking dribble move is gonna be a run over the ball, exit the opposite way, through the gate, I go ahead and I do a slow pivot drag towards the drill, and I come back around, and now I'm gonna go ahead and cut with the inside of my foot, touching it two times. Tap, 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 and take it home. I'll go ahead and show you the escaping move and the attacking dribble. Go ahead and see if you can try this. Ready, set, go. So last drill, we're gonna go ahead and do the same thing. We're gonna change up the move when we turn. We're gonna change the escaping move and the attacking dribble, doing under, over, and faking with their body. So I'll start off juggling a couple, popping it up, and it parts from behind. I'm gonna go ahead and do two chops with the inside. One, two. Then I'm gonna go ahead and exit towards the gate diagonal from me. I'm gonna go ahead and do a slow behind and then the other foot still behind. I'll do left when I'm going the left side and then back going right. The side that I came from, I'm gonna go under and over and exit the opposite way. Go through my gate, I'm on the right side and I do a slow behind right. I go back and I go in and out my cones. Here's the creativity part. You on your own as quick as possible, only use it in and out side, inside outside of the foot, no soul, and bring it back home. I'll go ahead and show you how the escaping move looks like. So behind and the attacking dribble move. Ready, set, go.